time once again for the law and you joining us today we have attorneys molly clark and ed sarah Boley. so mm -hmm. nice to have you back in studio it is good to be here with both of you how's your summer going it's going fantastic uh busy you know, yeah. kids are running us around like you know running around like crazy but it's, right. been, it's been, a, been a nice summer and you look nice and tan. You're getting some sun. Just got back from Cape May. <gasps> Ooh, lovely. She loves, she loves back the from beach. vacation I do time love the beach. to work nice <laughs> yes. and hard. So let's get some free legal advice today. This question's coming from Sophia from Shavertown. She's saying, I was driving behind a dump truck and garbage flew out. I had to swerve and run off the road. What should I do? Right. So, Sophia, um, you know, the first thing that you need to do is report this to your insurance company because. Um, if, if you ultimately can't find the owner of the dump truck, then you're going to be able to put a claim in as long as you have uninsured motorist coverage because this is what's called a phantom vehicle, meaning that there was a phantom vehicle that caused you to run off, run off the road. If you can find the owner of the dump truck, you know, ha having the license plate, then you're going to have to put them on notice immediately um, in order to pursue a case. But, uh, but you definitely have a case. It just you know, depends on which way it goes. Right. I don't know. Um, we don't have enough facts here, but if you were able to get the phone number, there's sometimes numbers on the back of those trucks. Or like Eddie said, if you were able to get the license plate, that would be helpful. Maybe you had people in the car that could give statements for you, or maybe somebody on the side of the sidewalk or yeah. by the road saw it happen, and they would be able to give statements for you, or they might know the garbage truck or whatever. Um, but you have some investigation to do. You should probably give us a call, and we can help you out. Yeah, get, get, on, get to us you know, very quickly because... Um, especially in, in cases like this, if it is an uninsured motorist case, there are very, very, very strict requirements by the insurance company for you to put them on notice. So don't delay. All right, give them a call as soon as possible. You can also find more information online at their website and on social media. And if you have questions for the law and you, submit them to pahomepage.com.